hello guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is Kobe, and this is kai tech digital now once again i want to welcome everybody f um here if you are new over here um my name is Kobe, like i said and in today's video um we are going to design um you know show or uh, i'm going to show you how you can be able to um integrate live tv feed into your what into your website so let's say you there is a live tv um you know on youtube or on um facebook you know then you want to what you want it to come into your what into your website i'll show you how you can be able to what integrate it so at the end of the tutorial we're going to have um you know a live tv uh, menu link over here and then when somebody you know clicks on it um the person is going to what have this live tv opened for him or her and then him or her will be able to or he or she will be able to what we able to you know play or watch the live feed okay so this is um basically an al jazeera live feed okay so the person can be able to watch it as what as a live what tv which is um very great so if you want to you know watch this um tutorial um just stick with me and let's jump into the tutorial now like i said if you are new over here i will entreat you to like and subscribe to the channel if you are old also please like the channel uh, li like the video for me it will you know help boost the youtube algorithm so um if you want you know a very nice beautiful website like this this is um, a church website if you need something like this you can you know hire me for me to what do um this for you okay so this website have everything that a church will need it ha even have what a radio integrated what into it okay so if you need something like this you can hire me for me to what um you know create it for you if you also want to watch how i design this website there is a um, a video on the channel okay on my channel if you go onto the channel um, you know just um, search for church video okay or how to create a church website you see that there is what um, a video on how to create a church website just like this one and then you can be able to what, also create it on your own but if you can't create it and then you still want me to what, design it for you you can also what um, hire me contact me and then I what I'll design it for you now let's you know jump into the video and then learn how we can be able to what um get a live tv on our what, on our website okay guys so first of all make sure that you log on to your um admin dashboard that is your wordpress admin dashboard and then you you are going to find something similar to this one depending on what kind of plugins that you've installed but basically what we are going to use or the plugin that we'll be using is just elementor and then um, we we just copy the link and then we paste it over there so it's very simple what we're going to do is first we're going to create a page okay so let's go to um pages over here and then you know click on add new okay so now that we are here now make sure that you give your page a title okay so i'm going to call it tv okay so i'm going to call it just tv or you can name it live tv or whatever that you want to name it but i'm just going to call it tv and then i'm going to change the template from here like i said make sure that you have elementor installed okay so if you don't know how to install em elementor just go over here over on what plugins over here and then click on what add new okay and then in the plugin session make sure that you search for let me let me go over there and then you know take you through it so when you click on add new you're gonna um it's gonna bring you to this page okay now over here make sure that you search for what um elementor search for element elementor okay search for this plugin over here so this is the plugin so um elementor website with builder okay so i'm just going to update it but then if you don't have it on it you see that you're going to have something like this install now 
okay so for me i'm going to update it just update it and then when you install it will tell you to what to activate it okay so that is it so install and then what activate it now when you install and activate it make sure that um you hover on pages over here click on what add new to add new what page okay now this will show over here and then give your page what a name now on the under the template over here on this side on the right side over here where um, um this says what page okay on the page tab under the template over here um you know change the default template to what elemental full width okay it depends on what you want you can change it to canvas to cover all the what the areas of but then i want it just what full width and then click on what um publish okay so now that i've published my 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 page okay i have a tv page published but there is nothing on it if you take a look at it let's take a look at how it looks there is nothing on it okay so as you can see there is what there is nothing over here okay so what we're going to do is we're going to um you know um display the live tv feed over here okay so we go back let's let me close this one let's go back over here and then click on what edit with elementor okay to open the elementor page builder for us so that's exactly what we're going to do now of course you can use the normal um, gutenberg page builder to what to do it but uh, i prefer elementor that is why i use elementor to uh, to design it now once i'm over here i'm going to click on this plus icon over here now for those of you who are who will be confused over here don't worry i'm using the container um you know structure type okay so um if you can also you know um, use your own kind of like um column structure okay but i'm using the container structure type so um i want to what use this um you know um container okay over here okay so as you can see it is just like having a structure okay so i want this to use this um container or structure and then um I, what i want to do is you know i want to give it a top and down um you know margin so i'm going to go over here and then give it um top and then bottom margin okay so i'm going to give it 90 top and then 90 bottom okay so that i'll have um you know the um how do you call it um the 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 the, the live feed display over here now i'm going to come over here and then with the minimum height i'm going to give it um let's say 700 okay yeah 700 minimum what height so you can give it any minimum height that you want you can even give it what a view height okay over here but i'm going to give it 700 okay so now that i have it like this i can what go ahead and then display my what my um you know my video over here so i'm going to get a video from youtube okay so i will go to youtube over here now there are a lot of live feed f on youtube okay people are doing live um you know there are some tv stations that uh, broadcast live on what on youtube okay so what i'm going to do it i'm going to search for al jazeera al jazeera live tv news okay so that is exactly what i'm going to do now as you can see they are broadcasting what live okay now if you see um channels television live stream is also over there okay there are a lot of what um you know live stream which is what going france 24 also broadcasting what live okay you can see it a lot of what news channel broadcasting what live and that is exactly now i'm going to pick al jazeera so what i'm going to do is i'm going to click on it okay and then i'm just going to copy this um you know url over here okay so um, I'm gonna close this one. I'm gonna pause this one and then copy just the URL, okay? And then come back to my page, okay? Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click this plus icon over here. And I'm gonna drag in the video um, um, widget over here, okay? I'm gonna drag in drag in the video widget over here. So now that I have this video widget dragged in it, so as you can see, this is a video widget. Now I'm gonna paste the Al Jazeera um you know link that i what i copied okay and as you can see i have it over here displaying for me nice one nicely done okay so now that i have it done 
now there is a, lo a little bit of space over here so i want uh, what i want to do is i just want to what um you know reduce the um the height a little bit so i'll click on this six dot icon and then with a the minimum height i'm going to make it like 600 okay yeah i think 600 is what is okay so then i have my what my live feed over here all what i need to do is what to click on update okay so now my live feed from youtube is what is is um you know broadcasting now if i want to view it let me click over here and then click on view page now i can go over there and then view the page okay so as you can see this is what t um the website name sl um, slash tv okay so this is what the live speed not feed now if i click over here you realize that the live feed will be what will be um, playing for me so that is what that is i can be watching um you know live tv on my own website okay as simple as that's very very easy to do okay now that this method is from what is from youtube now what if you want to um you know insert a live a live feed from facebook okay so from facebook it's also very simple i'm going to take you through how to do that on facebook so let's go to the next side okay now on the same place i'm what i'm going to do is i'm just going to hide or i'm, I'm not even going to hide i'm going to uh, duplicate this one over here okay so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to uh, duplicate this one so that i'm going to have what uh, two things over here now i'll hide this one okay so that um it wouldn't display okay so what i'm going to do is i'll just go to advance over here and then responsive this I'll, i'm just going to uh, hide everything okay so that it, it will just show only one instead of what uh, the two now i'm going to go to facebook okay so i'll, I'll let me go to facebook right now facebook.com so for those of you who wants to follow me on facebook you can do it um you can search for kwabina asari and then you can what add me as a friend okay this is me over here okay so on facebook also i'm just going to um let's say watch over here okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to search for what you see this one three says what live okay now this can be your own live feed okay you can um you know do your own live feed over there okay so um this is what a live feed happening right now in a radio station in ghana okay this is also a live feed this is also a live feed as you can see there are a lot of what live feeds over here okay so um a lot of live feed, uh, feed going on i can pick any of them and then what show it okay so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to pick this one so what should i do or what i'll do is what um let me click on share and then it will say that what copy link or copy embed okay so what we're going to do is we want to embed this live feed into our website so we're going to what click on what um, embed do not copy the link okay just click on the embed and then you're going to have this one okay all what you need to do is what just copy what the code click on it to copy the code okay copy the code and then come back to your um let me close this one after copying the code come back to your website over here okay now i'm going to remove this one from it because we have two over there so i'm going to remove this one delete this one okay so let me check this one oh okay so let me undo this one because this is not the one that i want to remove i want to remove this one rather okay so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to click over here right click it and then delete this one yeah so i'll have this one now what i'm going to do is i'm going to search for short code okay this one over here and then i'll drag it over here and then i'll paste in um the iframe code over there okay so as you can see this is the live feed happening live the one that we copied from facebook over here okay but what happens it's just um you know very um the the height is what so short so what you can do is just go through the what the um 
uh, the code over here okay now don't be don't be like don't let it scare you okay now look make sure that you 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 search for width and then height okay now with the height increase it to what to let's say 600 so that we're gonna have you know um uh, 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 the height which is what we we really want okay so as you can see we have the height which is what 600 just as our what our um, um how do you call it our main you know um, container height okay over here so now click on update click on update and then come to um, um over here where you the tv is what is showing and then what refresh it and then as you can see you have what you have the live feed also what from youtube showing over here okay as simple as that and that is how you can be able to uh, display um you know um live feed into your what into your website now now that you know how to display how do you show it on the what on the menu okay it's also very simple let's go back to the dashboard of our website so let me go to the dashboard over here i'm gonna go to the dashboard and then we are going straight to our menus okay go straight to your menus now under the appearance over here under appearance um you know locate menu click on it and then what we are going to do is we're just going to uh, display the um the tv over there so as you can see this is what the tv so just um you know tick it and then click on what add to what add to menu now you have it over here now what do we have to do just write live tv okay and then click on what save okay now if you come over here and then refresh the website you can see you have what you have the live feed showing over here okay a live tv showing what over here and that is what and that is how you can be able to uh, display it on your what on your menu also so that anybody who comes to your website will be able to what be able to see this what live tv and then also what watch it now you can show a lot of what live tv on your website not on the same page but on different different pages and then you add it over here as what sub menu so that when when somebody um hover on um live tv the sub menu what will display over here and then the person can choose any other tv that station that he or she wants to watch so i hope this tutorial is very helpful to you and then um i i hope you learned a lot from this tutorial also and then um, i'm hoping it will guide you in whatever thing that you want to what, use it to do thank you for watching and please subscribe to the channel so that we grow together thank you for watching see you in the next video bye bye